Hi there. Now for this part of the question, we're given that the curve has an equation y equals f of x and is such that f dash x or f prime x is equal to 3x to the power half plus 3x to the power minus a half minus 10. And it is given that the curve y equals f of x passes through the point 4 minus 7. And we've got to find f of x for 4 marks. So if you'd like to have a go at this and haven't done so already, just give you a moment to pause the video. OK, welcome back then if you had a go. So to find out what f of x is, we need to integrate f dash of x. OK, so if we just copy this down that f dash of x then was 3x to the power half plus 3x to the power minus a half and then minus 10. We're integrating all of this and it consists of three terms so we need to put that in brackets and integrating that with respect to x. So in the usual way when it comes to integrating this just add 1 to the power so it's going to be 3x to the power one and a half or three over two and then just divide by the new power so it's divided by three over two and similarly for the next term we add one to the power so it's three x to the power a half and divide by that new power so got that and then for the constant that's going to be minus 10 x and then don't forget the constant of integration plus c and if we tidy these terms up, first of all, then for this one here, 3 divided by 3 over 2 gives us 2. And you've got 2x to the power 3 over 2 then. 3 divided by a half is 6, so that's plus 6x to the power half, minus the 10x then, plus the constant of integration, plus c. Now, we've got to work out what that constant of integration is, and we know that when x equals 4, f of 4 must equal minus 7. It's the y value then, OK, since y equals f of x. So therefore, we can say that now f of 4 must equal the minus 7. So if we substitute 4 into here, we therefore have 2 multiplied by 4 to the power 3 over 2 plus 6 multiplied by 4 to the power half minus 10 times 4 plus the c will equal minus 7. So it's just a question of solving this equation and getting what c is. So if we simplify our terms here 4 to the power 3 over 2, square root of 4 is 2, 2 cubed is 8, 2 times 8 is 16. Then we've got 6 times the square root of 4, which is 2, 6 twos are 12. Then minus 40 plus c equals minus 7. And so we've got here minus 12 then plus c equals minus 7. And from this, if we add 12 to both sides, c is equal to minus 7 plus 12, which gives us 5. And so if we substitute this back into our equation here for f of x, we therefore have f of x equals 2x to the power 3 over 2 plus 6x to the power half minus 10x and then plus that constant of integration, which we just worked out, which is 5. And there you go.